In this short video I will show you how the new personal help feature in Parallels Access can be used to assist a remote friend with an issue on their Mac. There are several ways to do this, but I will be accessing the remote Mac from my iPad. Hey Kurt, I like how you have your font set up on your Mac. I just purchased some new fonts. Can you help me install them and set up my Mac in the same way? Hi Kayla. Happy to help. I am sending you an email with a special download link that will enable me, and only me, to remotely connect to your Mac with Parallels Access. Just follow the instructions to set everything up. Setting up now. Downloading Parallels Access. Installing. All done. I see your Mac on my iPad. I am establishing a link. You have to approve my access request. You always have to explicitly approve any remote help session in Parallels Access. Approved. I see your Mac's desktop, and I see the folder of fonts you want to add. Notice that there is an alert on your screen showing you that I have remotely connected to your Mac. This Parallels Access alert will always be there when I am connected. The first thing to remember in font management is to label these fonts so you can easily find them when you move to your next Mac. I do this by marking them with a color like this. Then, I will open up your library so that we can put these fonts in your font folder. The library is hidden on the Go menu, but I can reveal it by holding down the Option key. Ten minutes of font management help removed. OK. We are done now. See how everything shows up and looks great in font book. These fonts will work in all your applications. This looks great. Thanks Kurt. You're the best. You're welcome, Kayla. I will close the remote session now. See you soon. I hope you have seen how useful Parallels Access is. Get a 14-day trial of Parallels Access and try out remote connections for yourself. Thanks for watching.